And back to the weather, the unexpected heavy snowfall may have caused bitterly cold weather, but it's left Monique Hubert from Edenvale warm in the heart. She and her fiancé Rui had an agreement that they would get married the next time it snows in the city of gold. This is how it all started, with a mail sent to the station by the now bride's sister Lorica. It read as follows. Please can somebody help me? My sister and fiancé made an agreement that the next time it snows in Johannesburg, they will get married. We're looking for a magistrate that would be able to assist. As a belief, as a belief, as a belief. Monique Hubert and Roy Mocker need to get married today. We went on at four o'clock with this mail and with the crazy, crazy, overambitious idea of organizing and performing a wedding in three hours live on radio. That's when we opened the phone lines and the SMSs and got some suggestions in. We asked the question, what does it take to put on a full on wedding? Fortunately, with suggestions came in offers and sponsors, and that's where the whole, that's where the magic started, that ended up in, uh, in the fairy tale wedding. The fiance, potential bride. Monique, hello. Monique. Yes. This Martin Bester is spun from Jack and Randall. We're going to do it today. Is she right? Woo! This freaking was very exciting. This was very, very exciting. Then, of course, we needed a pastor. Pastor Francois Joubert, he phoned in and offered his services. Ned Flores came forward, they sponsored Monique's bouquet. Charnay then came in and did some flower arrangements for us for the studio. It's all happening, I hope you're happy today, but it's cool, it's cool. It's a lot of feelings, I feel the devil, I can't my feet full, I can't my heart full, I can't my mouth full, my mouth is It was just absolute, absolute madness in this radio studio. And I really feared that, that fear that things might get out of control. So Vili called in and said, I'm a wedding planner. I said, Vili, get your butt over here right now. Could it be a wedding without a beautiful wedding dress for the bride? The next thing, Nadine from the wedding dress company, who heard all this and was around the corner from the studio, decided to rush over here and come to our aid. First dress that Monique tried on fitted her like a glove. It was absolutely beautiful like it was made for. What else would go with a beautiful wedding dress? We need hair and makeup for the bride. Thank goodness for Yolandi from Style Productions. We heard this on the radio, called us up and said, listen, I'm on my way. What else does a wedding need? A cake, right? Isabella's called us up and offered to sponsor us a beautiful, beautiful wedding cake. Uh, wedding cake, we have a honeymoon suite, we have uh, flowers from Nick Florence. We got liquor, we got, got liquor, a champagne. champagne. We've and got it's a all limousine. happening right here. Live. All of it live right yeah. now. Oh, that's awesome. Yes. That's amazing. Yes. So, this crazy, crazy, very ambitious idea to organize and perform a wedding in three hours, thanks to all these people turned out to be an absolute fairy tale wedding that no one will ever forget. You must be the bride. People refer to it as the snow wedding. It happened on the 7th of August 2012, the day it snowed in Johannesburg. Uh, Monique and Roy got married in style, I'm very happy to say. Uh, thanks to my amazing team on air and uh, behind the scenes and all these people that came forward and sponsored and pulled it off magnificently. Thanks to every single person who made it happen. Um, on behalf of Monique and Roy, I think it's going to be something they will share with their kids one day and that they will never, never, ever forget.